We love cutting edge technology on the cafe that can help make life easier. In home design this morning, Hamish has brought along an expert to help us out. In fact, Hamish, you brought a man in. I did, I did. I've brought in Dylan and he's going to talk about the latest tech with washing machines and even how it matches up with your cell phone. Oh, nice. Well, welcome, Dylan. Welcome to the cafe. Yeah. Okay, when it comes to washing machines, reliability is a big one. Uh, so yep. what is different about this one? So a lot of people consider the washing machine the real workhorse of the house, right? And in a typical washing machine, you have the old belt and pulley to be able to spin the drum around, which is quite old-fashioned. Well, they still do that. It's yeah, crazy. Definitely. Yeah, definitely. Do you yep. even know what's in the back of your washing yeah, machine? Yeah, no, I do, yeah. I used to have one of those old ringer ones, you know. <laughs> <laughs> the washboard yeah, to do that with. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Walked five miles in the snow to do it too, Yeah, you? that's right. Yeah. I lived in a shoebox. <laughs> so what's different in these ones is the motor is actually attached directly to the drum. So by eliminating all those extra little pieces, you know, because you're used to hearing a washing machine kind of rumble through the house as it spins up, but well, you don't get that anymore. And it also has a 10-year warranty because, you know, less moving parts and it's more reliable. So it doesn't sound like a plane's taking off every time you put a load on? No, you don't hear that kind of spin up as you're walking around the house. Yeah, that shuddering, that sort of judder and everything starts going like this yeah, on the kitchen bench. Yeah, That's the inverter drive motor, yeah? Yep, so the direct drive motor is direct. straight to the drum. Mm, I like it, I like it. That's modern. Okay, now tell me this. There are lots of different sort of settings you can do with your washing machine. Okay, yep. uh, run through a couple for me for different fabric types. So, because we have more control over the washing machine because of that motor being directly attached, it has something called six motion wash. So, if you imagine, say you have a rugby jersey or a delicate dress, if you were going to hand wash them, you wouldn't use the same sort of motion to do that, right? No, no. They're completely different. different. Yep. Yeah. But a normal washing machine, when you wash something like that, all it can adjust is the spin speed or how long it washes for. Yeah. But with these new washing machines, it can actually adjust the action of the fabric. So if it's something delicate, it will actually wash it more delicately. So how does it do that? It's like little magic hands come out and well, go... It, I watched the video. It doesn't go all the way round, does it? It's got like a swinging cycle. Yeah, because with the belt and pulley, you can't stop and start the drum. Right. Whereas this one, you can. So you can create kind of like a figure eight for the clothes to move or drop them back down on themselves. Wow. Yeah. That yeah, is pretty just, impressive. Yeah, looking at that footage, that is pretty impressive. OK, now, before I heard you mention you can use this with your smartphone, because I'll tell you a couple of things I love about this new LG washing machine already. The fact that you can put it on at night time when people are asleep, it's not going to be noisy. I'm now controlling it from your smartphone, that's going to make life easier. How does it work? That's right, so basically if you have an Android phone, you've probably already noticed that then on the washing machine there's an NFC tag. Mm -hmm. So when you press the two together, they recognise mm -hmm. and it tells you to install. And there's two great things you can do. First one, if you've forgotten to turn the hot tap on, it will tell you that without having to embarrass yourself with a service agent. Oh, yeah. And the other <laughs> one... We've never done that. <laughs> the other thing is you can actually download new wash programs. Wow, so you mean if I've got something special that I want to wash, I can download something specially for it? That's right. What about sequins? <laughs> sequins? Well, I don't have any of them personally. Really? Try it. <laughs> I thought you want my man to go to the sequins. Uh, I've got a question for you. Say, for example, you wash things like maybe Glad Wrap and marbles and maybe toy soldiers oh and cars. What do you do about that? Well, Glad Wrap's tricky because it's going to stick inside the drum. But yeah. for small things like coins, there's actually a little flap at the front of the washing machine that you can open up yeah. and all let all those sort of things out. Wow. Now, I'm new to the front-loading washing machine, and I've noticed with mine that I, it locks me out, you know, so I've turned it on. That's right. And then I forget things, typically sock slash something else yeah. that's meant to be washed. I run, try and open it, and I can't get in for an hour 20. Yeah. That's right. So we've all been there. We've walked down the stairs, dropped a sock. Yeah. But um, what we can do is you press a pause button on the front. So the same button that you use to start the washing machine is also pause. Yeah. Right. So you can just pause it. Five seconds later, you can <gasps> that throw your is extra genius. sock in. That's been, the thing that, it's been the thing that's put me off front load is that you couldn't get it in. And finally, how long can it, does it take, though? Does it take like an hour and a bit to make it to do a wash? If you're just watching, washing some gym gear or something, yeah. 14 minutes. 14 mm. minutes. Yeah, that's Brilliant. fast. That sounds pretty good. Nice yeah. work. And hassle-free, you know, warranties, because it is a hard-working engine in the house, isn't it? Find out about the sequins. <laughs> <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Thanks so much, Hamish and Dylan. There's so much new technology out there, and LG seem to be at the forefront of it. If you want more information, you can head along to lg.com slash nz.